report, soldier. Any luck? None, sir. We persuaded him, we threatened him, we even beat him. Still wouldn't talk. God damn it all. Unsurprising, though. Sadly. This one's stubborn. Too stubborn for his own good. Still, you did all you could. And that's admirable in itself. Now go. Get back to your regular shift. Damn it all. I'm at a loss. Divines. How can I get that damned guy to shut up and comply? What was that conversation about? It was about possibly the most stubborn prisoner we've ever captured and incarcerated here. We caught him crossing the border a few days ago. Since then, he's been raving incoherently. Well, he's coherent, but near delusional. We've been meaning to interrogate him, but every time I've sent one of my soldiers to do it, he's refused. And, you know the worst damned part? I feel for him. He's clearly somewhere between naive and insane. And the Penitus Oculatus aren't the most merciful sort. They'll come for him soon, make no doubt about it. And when they do, he'll face a fate much worse than any of my troops could dispatch. It's not the best situation, but my hands are tied. He'll be carted off by the Penitus Oculatus, the Empire's secret police. I've heard a lot about how they operate, none of it pretty. I'd prefer to resolve this situation here before sending this guy off to them. Divines know it'd probably be a fate worse than death. But, if no one's able to successfully interrogate him, well, my hands are tied. Some gold, sure. Why? You thinking of helping? It's not common practice, but considering what the alternative would be, and how uncooperative this particular prisoner is, I can't really say no. He's in the prison wing of the fort. One moment. Take this. A letter proving that I've given you authorization to go in there. Best of luck, and thanks for helping us with this. Hold. This is the prison wing of Fort Pale Pass. If you want to get in, I'm the one to grant you access. But I can only grant that access with the authorization of our commander, Legate Priscilius Varro. Let me take a look at that. Hmm, seems authentic. Yeah, that's the Legate's hand, all right. Okay. Head on in, I'll unlock the door. Do whatever you have to do. Oh, I should warn you. Once you head in there, we're putting the fort on high alert. Locking the doors. Just a heads up. This prisoner's been known to get a little... irate during questioning. Don't want him making a break for the exit door. All right, doors open. Good luck in there. Gods know you'll need it. These damned Imperial soldiers? Are you here to rescue me? Question? Ha! Do your worst, dog! I will never break! Never! 
Did Benetis Oculatus? After me? Oh, by Talos. What have I done? What have I gotten myself into? Fine, fine. I'll comply. I mean, no, I won't. Talos, I... Oh, by the divines. Because Skyrim is suffering under the Empire's yoke. We're not even allowed to worship our own damned gods. You wouldn't understand. You're an Imperial dog. A toady for the Dalmor. But we deserve freedom! And to truly achieve freedom, we need to end the Empire. Strike at its heart. Cyrodiil, the Imperial City. And the rest will crumble. Oh, Talos, here comes the damn Jailer. Just what I needed. Someone else to rub salt in the wound. I see your interrogation's going well. Better than any of the other sops that I've tried, at any rate. Bloody jailer. Come to gawk at the poor, helpless Stormcloak. You'll pay, damned Imperial! You'll all pay! <laughs> you say that every day. Still haven't found a way to break through those bars, though, have you? The information you've gotten out of him so far? Good work. You've gotten the basics out of him, but the Legate needs to know everything we can possibly extract. So... Well, best not let the prisoner hear our little chat. Follow me. See you. Thought we needed to get away from prying ears. Last thing we need is to let the prisoner in on our techniques. Now we know the guy's plot, heard it straight from the horse's mouth, but we need to know more. This time you need to take on a few different lines of attack. Find out who sent him, if he came with anyone else, and where they may be. And try not to lose track of time. The Pentatus Oculatus will be here soon, and the Legate wants us to get the information out of him, not them. Good luck. Talk to you later. You know what? While you were back there exchanging poisonous words with your jailer friend, I've decided I'm not talking. Mm-hmm. No more! Fine. Fine. I crossed the border through Serpent's Trail. An old smuggling route. I... We're not part of the main Stormcloak army. At least, not anymore. We call ourselves the Stormcloak Breakaways. Fine, fine. I'll tell you everything, silver-tongued scamp. There are others. Not sure how many. I was never in command, just their forward scout. One of them. At any rate. But I know of at least six others. Three of them crossed the border, came down here, not reported back in weeks. The others, three of them, waiting on the Skyrim side of the border, lying in wait, waiting for my report. Given that I've been stuck in here for days, bet they're running out of patience right quick. But he has connections. Stormcloak breakaways, eh? Hmm. So even Ulfric Stormcloaks aren't extreme enough for some of his flunkies. Pfft. <laughs> Stir-crazy Nords. Six accomplices. Hmm. Not quite an army, but a formidable force given a clever and able commander. I see. Well, thank you, I... What the... Quick, follow me! Stormcloaks have breached the fort. I'll stand watch here and keep an eye on that damned prisoner. Go find the Legate. Warn him. Let him know what's going on.
careful with that fire. You won't live here alive. This is my boy. Looks like that was the last what an oblivion are you doing? Soldier, report. Where's the prisoner? That's a relief. I guess these blasted stormcloaks are trying to rescue that damned prisoner. Divines forsake them, and Dagon take them. Stay on alert, everyone. Might be more of these stormcloaks yet. The Penitus Oculatus. Yes, yes. We are the Penitus Oculatus. A thrill for soldiers posted in a frigid backwater such as this, I'm sure. The prisoner. Now, Varro. I... This one. Here. I hired them to interrogate him after our own efforts proved fruitless. I suggest you two have a conversation first. The Legate's disobeying command. You can't simply let him... Enough. Come then. Let us speak. And see whether or not your findings are as interesting as the Legate seems to believe. So, what did you discover? How many accomplices does he have? Where are they active? What faction does he belong to? Stormcloak breakaways. Interesting. But more importantly, accomplices. While this ill-fated little prison break revealed that much, the prisoner's confession suggests more widespread activity than previously assumed. Until next time. Ah. It seems the prisoner's here now. I must say, Leggett, your operation is quite efficient. Are you really going to take him away? His plot was stupid. There's no way he could have done it. He might be insane for all we know. The security of the Empire comes before all else, Leggett. You will come to understand this in time. You there! You may be a lapdog of the Imperials, but it's not too late! Put down these damned Imperials! Free me! Don't let them cut me away! Enough of these foolish overtures. This way. Yeah... Not exactly the outcome I was hoping for. But the Empire is what it is. The best damned hope for Tamriel, warts and all. Still, you did what I asked of you, and accomplished it well. Here's your payment. I'll try not to think of the poor guy's fate. Not even a Stormcloak deserves to suffer the Benedis Oculatus' interrogation techniques. Farewell. You're not one of these damned Imperial soldiers. Are you here to rescue me? Oh. Oh. A true daughter of Skyrim. My heart gladdens to see you in this hive of Imperial bootlickers. Free me? Oh, praise Thanos! All right, friend. First thing that needs done if I'm to get out of here is simple. Locking the damn cell. The way I see it, the best way is to jam something in the lock and fiddle it open. If you've got some breaking and entering experience under your belt. If you're not a born thief, though, the jailer. He has a key, but he won't give it up easy. Good luck, friend. Watch yourself, and may Talos guide you. Another worm. Today is a glorious day. Today is the day that Beardy Shatterstone is freed of his captivity. I thank you for releasing me from my captivity, friend. But as you no doubt know, this is only the first skirmish in the war. 
A war for my freedom. So, fellow prisoners, fellow captives of these Imperial Legion dogs, I ask you this. Do you stand with me? By stand with me, you mean get the Oblivion out of here, right? Yes, of course you will. But you'll also get to stand with the mighty... Yeah! All right, friend. Would seem Talos smiles on me today. He's hoping I remain in his favor in the moments to come. We're going to have to get out of the fort, one way or the other. Question is, how will we do it? We've got a jail full of bitter prisoners here, ready to take up arms against the Empire for their freedom. I say we give them that chance. But what say you? <laughs> Friend, I like the way you think. I knew we were kindred spirits the moment I set eyes on you through the bars of my cell. Well then, best hop to it, eh, friend? May Talos guide us. It's now or never, friend. Rescue the other prisoners if you want to build up a little entourage to help us get out of here alive. Otherwise, we'd best get cracking. What? No, I want to stay rotting here in the cell forever. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, the look in your face. <sighs> Lead on, friend. Can I help you? If it means I get free of this place, absolutely. Lead on. Careful with that fire. Like I told that loudmouth Nord guy, if it means I get out of this stinking prison, I ain't complaining. I'm with you. Farewell. Hey! I heard talk amongst the guards on my way in. To the right. That leads to our freedom. But to the left, the captain's quarters. Might be worth skulking around in there. I bet the captain has some things we could use. over their underlings, if my experience is any indication. I have an idea. I have a few allies, breakaways from the main Stormcloak army, waiting for me on the other side of the border. I say, you grab the horn quickly, then we take it up top and blow it loud as we can. Summon some help for the confrontation up ahead. Up to you, though. with that fire all right we're here are you ready to summon the reinforcements good i hope this works all right here goes nothing All right. I 
think that about did it. Told the lads and lasses beforehand to listen out for a signal. Hopefully they put two and two together. Right, well. Feeling think clumsy we best get today. back to the whole getting the oblivion out of here thing, eh, friend? Time of desperation, out of a desire to spare that prisoner the horrors of the Penitus Oculatus. I put my faith in you, stranger. You betrayed that trust. Instead, you decided to free a Stormcloak from captivity and storm your way through an Imperial fort. No longer a contractor, but instead a traitor. While you were in there, the Oculatus arrived. I had feared they'd subject the prisoner to a fate worse than death. I wanted to spare him that. But now I see. I see that you both deserve that fate. The Oculatus agrees, and I intend to help them along. I'm sorry I have to do this. Really, I am. But it's time to face the consequences of your actions. Thank you, friend, for all that you've done for me this day. To aid a Stormcloak in a jailbreak. On this side of the border, even. Well, it takes some stones. Takes some guts. Sadly, however, I suspect this is the part where we go our separate ways. I've got to reconnect with my brothers and sisters in Skyrim. There is much yet to do. Much yet to plan. And, well, friend, I need a rest. Some nice, warm me. Prison breaking gives a man a thirst. In terms of reward, as you probably guessed, I'm a little light on coin right now. But I promise I'll set right this debt as soon as I may. To that end, friend, care to tell me your name? Not sure I caught it before. Guess we were too busy muddling our way through hordes of Imperials, eh? Find a way to pay you back. Don't you worry. 